This tutorial is going to be on how to create a gradient background for your website. It's actually really easy. You can create a full size gradient background, but what you're doing then is actually downloading a huge file before you um, actually do it. What we're going to do instead is we're going to create a picture that is one pixel wide by about 400, between 400 and 500 um, pixels long. Keep the resolution at about 72 because there's not much point in having more resolution than that. So what I've got here is a really thin image and this is in Photoshop, not in Dreamweaver. What I'm going to do is I'm going to select the gradient tool and I'm going to select a gradient that I like the look of. This one here will do. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to stretch down my gradient. Now if I zoom in on that so that I can actually see it, I find that my gradient here goes from light to black. What I probably want is from black to lighter. So I'm going to reverse the direction that I just did my gradient in. Much better. Now you can't see that very well, but trust me, it looks good. What I'm going to do is I'm going to save that now. And I'm going to save it as a JPEG in my website folder. I'm going to call it um, just BG for the moment. And I'm going to make sure that my um, image quality here isn't right up to the maximum, but sort of is about medium. And hit OK. Now, if I go to Dreamweaver, what I want to do to insert the background there is go Modify Page Properties. And I want to change the background image here. So if I've got Appearance here, selected Background Image here to my BG and I'm going to choose. Now if I apply that there, what I find is that I have a nice gradient background. All right? And if I hit OK, that looks great. Now the problem then becomes though, if I have a lot on my website, sorry I'll just put that down, if I have a lot on my website and it goes down a fair amount, notice that what happens is that my gradient actually repeats this way as well as this way. So what I've got here is one pixel that's repeated all the way along, but it's also going to repeat downwards as well. So I want to return turn that um, repeat downwards off so that I don't have this line here. So if I go back to page properties and I go to my background here, I want it to repeat on the Y Sorry, I don't want it to repeat on the Y. I only want it to repeat on the X. So the X is this way, so I want it to repeat from left to right, but I don't want it to repeat up and down and hit apply. So what I get then is this beautiful white background, which isn't much that much better to me. So I'm going to select a background color. Now, rather than going here and trying to match exactly what that red is, on Dreamweaver, I can actually just bring my eyedropper over here and select the red straight off that image and hit apply. So what it looks like now is I've got a gradient here that actually doesn't seem to end so it'll always